Have you ever felt weighed down, restricted, or hindered by unseen forces? Could it be that you are under an evil covenant or yoke? The scriptures provide answers and solutions to such spiritual challenges. Consider Jeremiah 18.11, where we are advised to listen to the statutes and judgments of God. This verse is a call to align our lives with God's divine instruction, a way of life that ensures we are not ensnared by evil covenants or yokes. In prayer, we can seek God's assistance in adhering to his statutes, thus breaking free from any unseen chains. Next, Psalm 34, 17 assures us that God hears the cries of the righteous and delivers them from all troubles. This scripture provides confidence that God will hear our pleas for deliverance from any oppressive yokes. When we pray with faith, we trust in God's power to set us free. In 2 Corinthians 10, 3, 5, we find that our warfare is not of the flesh. Our weapons are divinely powerful and effective in destroying fortresses of evil covenants and yokes. Through prayer, we can access these divine weapons, enabling us to take every thought captive to the obedience of Christ. Isaiah 54, 17 is a testament to the protective power of God. It reassures us that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. This scripture serves as a shield, protecting us from any evil covenants or yokes as we pray and stand on God's word. Finally, James 4, 7 encourages us to submit to God and resist the devil. This scripture is a call to action, a call to resist the temptations of evil covenants and yokes through prayer. When we submit to God and resist the devil, we are assured of freedom from any form of spiritual bondage. In summary, the scriptures provide a blueprint for breaking evil covenants and yokes through prayer. By listening to God's statutes, crying out to him in times of trouble, wielding the powerful weapons of prayer and faith, standing on his word, and resisting the devil, we can break free from any form of spiritual bondage. Always remember, God's promises are sure, and he is faithful to deliver. Stand firm on his word and experience the liberating power of prayer.